Thank you all so much. Thanks to all my subs. And the reason I came down here, the Fox Car came. Welcome home, brothers and sisters. We're from Camp Pork Chop. It's across the swamp from the shitter. playing songs we know. Ah! Oh. By the way, give it up for the horn section. Those guys that work shedding. Work shedding up in Portland to come up with those chops. Awesome.
seeing as there's so many kids around, this seems appropriate. <laughs>
good living So from the world I hid Disgusted with my fellow man And the evil that he did If there weren't men like Glenn Beck Then the evil would be with That's when I got it in my head to start to kill a little kid I got it in my head to start to kill a little kid Oh, 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 You still staying cool? I remember that. You wrote that in my yearbook. Stay cool. See you in 30 years.
And I was saying a moment ago. Tori fucking Utah. Awesome. I got to sing for my favorite band. Subject to change. You run it. Is we, here we are in Torrey, Utah, and thank you again, John and Angel, for the hosting this freaking thing. But back in the very, very, very old days, um, we wrote this song about there's this. You, I'm sure you might have met, known him or even met him, but this guy named Crispin Glover, and uh, he was sort of an inspiration to me and Camber Lango, and we wrote a song about him. And he appears in so many of Trent Harris's films, and Trent just lives up the road at Big Mel. And you should come down to the film festival sometime. <laughs> so yeah, it's all it's all about the Aquarius Plateau, people.
nostalgic this weekend, aren't I? A lot of these songs I, li I wrote when I lived down in Los Angeles, and then when I moved back to Salt Lake City, I found these ragamuffins, and, and uh, hell, we, we learned a couple, so here's one of those. Thank you. 
Um, it was always supposed to be kind of a Bakersfield fast kind of feel to, to it. And then uh, we wanted to play at the Zephyr, and they said, well, you need a lot of slow songs so people can dance. So then we slowed it down, and I didn't really like it. So I'm going to make these guys play it uh, the way it was written. She was sleeping in the lobby of the Kennedy Hotel. Expecting a check from Jerry Joseph next week. No joking. I'm I'm very psyched. Shout out, Jerry! Check, $91. Hey, I'm psyched. 
<laughs> never made any any uh, royalties before ever. <laughs> Twenty five years later. Thank you. <laughs> not even for that. When I was just a kid, well, we didn't have much. Broken down truck with a busted up clutch. Keep on looking for a gentleman 
they do. John Jim and Andy. But I love it. Bread. I love working for you people. That's the, uh, that's the only reason. That's why I'm here. If you, if you guys will give John Jim in a few minutes, he needs to take a fucking smoke break. <laughs> you know, you know, Kerry Pedersen has it mastered. Does that guy have a doubt or what? That guy can chain smoke a pack of cigarettes in like a 30 minute sort of gamma ray set. Master, master of that. <laughs>
So once again, thank you, thank y'all. What the hell? This is awesome.
Good Thank night. Thank you, everybody. And in case you were answering, wondering the answer to the question, this is the real people. This is the real chef right here. On the horns, huh? Are you kidding me? Oh, oh, and and it gets better. The way downs from Portland, Oregon, are gonna close the night out. Insane, awesome. Thank you.